Hey guys. So, Bloons Monkey City got its contested territories back yesterday. I was going to do a video on this then, but unfortunately I crashed on round 115, so <laughs> I was planning on getting footage there, but didn't manage to. Um, I came back today and decided to have another shot, so round 99 at the moment, and going fairly well. So we've actually got a challenge in contested territories now, which is awesome. I mean, last time you could get over 200 with pretty much no trouble, it was so easy which was kind of problematic because you literally had to sit there for hours to get there. The only reason we stopped at 202 was because you just couldn't get any further. It literally, it wasn't that it was too hard, it was actually really easy, it just didn't let you progress, it just stopped, which is very problematic. There should never be a hard cap level on something like this. Um, I don't know, <clears throat> I don't know if we can actually reach 202 on this particular map to check if that cap is still there, but... On an easier map, we probably could reach 200. Maybe like the um the the clover one, maybe or um whichever the really circly one. <laughs> what do I call that? I don't know. I completely forgotten. But I reckon on one of those, we probably could reach 200. It might be difficult, but it uh, might be possible as well. So we might have to check that sometime. But for now, this is actually a really fun challenge. I The first time I tried, I lost on round 40 to DDTs. They, my temple couldn't cope with it, <laughs> which was a bit awkward. But uh, second time, I only managed to get to 54, so that was getting started there was actually really challenging. But after a while, I managed to sort out my, my early on strategy, and now I'm managed, able to get to like the hundreds. But it's actually quite difficult. I mean, look here, I've got... I, I, I've got a full free play setup here. I don't. I could add probably dartlings and um, aces to help me out, but I don't really want to do that just yet because <laughs> I want to try and avoid lag as much as possible. I mean, I've probably got too much for the moment anyway, but I want to avoid nasty surprises because it does seem to scale fairly fast. Um, <laughs> but yeah, you see, the DDTs they get so fast. Uh, <laughs> I, um, getting, yeah, they they get so far, sorry. I reckon eventually my only hope at surviving the DDTs will probably be just popping a bunch of spike storms right at the start of the match. So just to take out the first ones to give my, um, my spike factories enough time to actually set up a nice defense back here. Because the problem with early DDTs is they go, they go past you when you're, um, when your spikes haven't actually started building up their piles yet, as you can see there. It's not really too big an issue at the moment, but as they get faster and faster, they avoid more and more, and I, they also get more health. So, yeah, it is a bit of a problem. Um, there we go. Um, but yeah, it's pretty nice, because the only way I can actually pass 100 is by pretty much using abilities, which in, like, Bloons Town Defense 5, for example... You don't really need abilities to get past 100. You can do it with one temple. <laughs> Just one temple, that's enough. And, I mean, these are more powerful than regular temples. Although, like, this map does ban apprentices in ice, so these are weaker than they could be. But they're still very powerful temples, and they're... Yeah. I know, I'm pretty satisfied with the level of difficulty of contested territories at the moment. Um, I am thinking that maybe... We could start scaling it faster after the hundreds, maybe, but I haven't really got far enough to really make that kind of call yet, so I'll just keep testing and see how it goes. It's pretty fun, though. I, um, if you're looking for a challenge in, in actual Bloons Tower Defense 5 free play, then I recommend coming over to Bloons Monkey City and trying this out, because this is this is how a free play should be in Bloons. I mean, it's, it's not just that, whatever, month-long spam fest... Or in Bloons Tower Defense 5 with no challenge until like really late on. It's it's actual early challenge instead of long drawn out rounds. It's not a waiting game really. Because that's all that Bloons Tower Defense 5 free plays. It's just waiting, see who's more patient. That's really who gets the top scores there. Here it's actually a bit of a challenge. Or it is so far at least. <laughs> I'm, I'm satisfied for now. I'm going to keep doing these. And I, f I do enjoy this, so 
I hope you guys enjoy this as well. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I uh, will be probably. I will, um I got to level 100 in SAS. Uh, was it yesterday? I don't know. I put a video up. I'll I will be explaining my skills about that soon. So look forward to that. And I'll see you around.